Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel for another scary type game. This is going to be a game I call Mas Masokisha, I think it is. I know it's like a medical kind of condition type of game, and I think it goes off the word of masochism, which is like a, like a fetish based off killing people, basically. Like, it's how people get turned on by killing people. I'm not really sure what that is all about and why people would even choose that lifestyle. I don't know. I weird people in the world. But anyways, this is going to be Maso Keisha. I think I'm just going to call it that. I'm probably butchering it. And I'm sorry. This is a experimental psychological game made by Old Blood. Um, I'm not really familiar with the company, but on Steam, it came out on October 9th. On Steam, it has some positive reviews on it. That's a great storyline. Great, like, horror thriller kind of map for the month of October. It's perfect since we are in the Halloween season. The Halloween's in 10 days, you guys, of filming this video. 10 days, probably nine nine days for you guys. So I thought it would be fun to go ahead and play it. Uh, I've seen a, a couple people played the demo of it when it came out earlier this year. I'm not really positive on that, though. I've never heard of it until I bought it on Steam on the 9th, so... That's as far as I know. But for a quick little description of it, it says, A young man discovers through a series of hallucinations that he will grow up to become a violent psychopath. How will he respond to these revelations? Can he change his fate? Can you even change fate? That's basically the story. That's all it has right there. That's the only description it has on here. Um, other than the fact that it's an experimental psychological game. So I hope you guys do enjoy it. If you guys are new to my channel, I'm Connor K. I play a lot of Sims video mainly, but since it is for the month of October, I thought we'd go ahead and add in some horror games to my channel. It's called Connor K Horror Days. I hope you guys have seen, have enjoyed it. If you guys have watched any of my videos, I don't think really anybody's watched Who Is Mike, which is the only game I did, but side note on that. But this is going to be the second horror game. I think it's like the main horror game that I was going to play for this month anyway, so why not and uh yeah i think that's pretty much it i think we'll go ahead and jump on in if you guys are returning to my channel welcome hope you guys do enjoy and let's go ahead and start uh maso Keisha. i don't really know what else to say to you guys <laughs> notice this game includes mature content pers pervasive language violence and oppressive themes recommend for ages 13 18 plus click no uh to immediately enter click next to proceed we're going to proceed, you guys. Hello, Hamilton. Oh, oops. Sorry, you guys. I totally did not mean to do that. Uh, so it looks like it's a it's a point-to-click game. So let's go ahead. It says E to continue. Did you run away again? <laughs> uh, who's there? Or, yes, you know how father can be. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go, who, who is there? Do you not know? Uh, I, I don't need you? Oh, Hamilton, without me, you're nothing. We are nothing. Okay, so it looks like we can search some stuff. There's a key right here. We could probably grab it. Okay, so an HT flex of rust and earth stain, its bow and blade. So E to open, I opens inventory, E to continue. Okay, so there's a door. Oh, so it looks like we can move around in this. It's a linear game, I'm assuming. We have this trap door. Okay, so we need a code for that, which we don't have. So we'll probably have to come back over to this door right here and unlock it. So if we do I, H key on this door. Oh, okay, we have to click and drag. No? Can we use it on this? I don't know anything about that. What else can we click on? Oh, we can move for, oh, we can move farther this way. That would probably make sense, you guys. H key on this. Yes, okay. So we can leave the shed. So we need to find four numbers, I think it was. Let's go back over to it and see what it was. So we need four. Okay, so we need to find four numbers to open that trap door. So we have to remember that we have it. So let's leave the shed. Okay. Hey, boo. Whoa. 
Whew. Okay. So, okay. My heart's beating a little bit. Okay. So, Act 1, The Family. Welcome back. What? What was that? They call him the Gray Man. I, I don't like him. I don't think he cares if you like him or not. Either way, I'm sure that I'm sure that we will soon see him again. You should head back home, Hamilton. Your poor mother. She must be worried sick about you. Can we leave the shed again? We have nothing to go in here, so... I guess let's try to leave one more time. Whew. Okay. Like, I'm scared I'm going to get jump scared. Like, I'm trying out the lights for this one. If you guys don't like it, let me know in the comments below if you want me to turn off the lights for it because it is kind of creepy. But I don't... I don't really think it's too bad. It's still scary. I already got scared anyways with the light on, with the lights on. So let's see. So we have that shed we were just in. There's a windmill this way. Move deeper into the valley. Okay, so we can go there. It's over this. Head back towards home. Okay, so it said we had to go back home to see our mom. Um... Let's move deeper into the valley just to see what that does. Okay, so we got closer to this tree. Move towards the shed. Okay. Please nothing pop up at me. Like, I'm going to, like, die. Okay. Just some windmills. Head towards the woods. Can we go back? Can we go back to the shed? Will we die if we go out here first? Let's see. Oh my god, this is so I'm like, I'm so scared of you guys. Okay, so we have no keys or anything. It looks pretty peaceful. I think. The woods? Oh, uh-uh. The the woods or the woods? Woods or the woods? I don't, I don't know, you guys. I'm kind of scared. But I want to check it out. Like, I feel like going straight to the home, like, precedes the game too fast. Sorry, I'm, like, adjusting these. They're, like, weird. But I feel like going to the house is, like, just adjusting. Let's go this way in the woods. These woods shouldn't be wandered without reason. Let us find a reason. These woods shouldn't be wandered without a reason. Let's find a reason. Okay, so it looks like we don't have a reason yet. I mean, I don't remember anything. Maybe our mom will set us back out here to go into them? Maybe? I'm not really sure because it doesn't look like there's anything for us. Okay. So we're still going back this way. Exactly how it was. I hope nothing jumps out on us. I don't like how it's like, like fogged out on the sides. Like it's kind of scary. Okay. So it looks like we're just going back to the house. There's nothing there in the way back. So let's just go back towards home. Okay. So let's towards the shed more. There's nothing over here. A home is creepy. I don't want to go home. I I don't want to go home. It's creepy. Home is creepy. No, thank you. I'm I'm okay staying away from home. But we can go towards the creek. Let's go see what the creek has to offer. Oh, peaceful, calm. I like this way better. Way better. So towards the valley. Doesn't look like there's anything else up here. There's the, the windmill more. And we can go downstream more. Oh, and it's letting us go too. Okay, so let's see. So we have upstream. Some rock. Oh, we can go towards the rain, which would be fun. I love the rain personally. Are, are things getting darker as we go towards... Do you guys see that? I swear it's getting darker. Okay, so what's over here? We can go downstream more. 
I want to see what's downstream a little bit more. So we can go back up. If when we go back up, we're gonna go across the river over to that um little stream over there. I have nothing. So that's towards what's it's gonna let us go in here. Nope. The woods shouldn't be wandered without reason. Let's find a reason. Okay, got you. So let's go back to across the creek. Go back here. Oops. Okay, so let's go down towards the sound of the rain. Dark things wait in the rain. I don't think you were prepared yet. Okay, so I guess we can't go there. I guess our only option is to go home then. I'm guessing the game is telling us to go home. Okay, you guys. Let's see what's at home. Okay, go inside. I don't want to go inside. It's too scary. Go back to the valley. Nothing in the windows. The backyard. Creepy swing. Oh my god. Oh, why did I jump? Why did I jump? Like, he's not even scary. Why are you back here, though? I don't know who you are. Go away from me. Okay. Okay, okay, cool. Meat cleaver. It's broad and heavy blade relies on your arm momentum to separate its target. Okay, so we have some numbers. 44, 45, 41, 44. I don't know what those mean. And there's nothing else over here. So I guess we have to talk to that kid. Like, freaking creepy. Hello. We'll be nice. The boy is silent. Why is it raising up? Who are you? Creepy. He's really... I don't know that I should talk to you. I was told to meet a boy with blood on his face. I don't see any on your face. It must not be you. Blood on his face? Are you alright? You just want to understand. Please. Leave me alone. Okay, fine. The boy's silent. Yeah, we know. Okay. Let's go back. There's nothing else over here, so let's go to the front yard. Okay, so he needs to meet a boy with blood on his face. I have a feeling we're going to have blood on our face soon enough. So let's back to the house. Okay. Let's go inside and see. Mmm. Creepy pictures. Yes. That's exactly what we need in our life. And we can only go. I. Ah, we can only go the other way. I don't want to go. I don't want to go. I don't want to go. Oh my god. They blink. Those blink. I swear to God, those blink. Oh my God, this is creepy, you guys. Talk about a dang horror game. I don't want to go to the parlor. It's scary. Look at the window. No, 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 no. I don't want to know. It's so scary. I'm such a big baby. Oh my God, I'm such a big baby. Hmm. <sighs> I am such a baby. We can go back to the fire. The door's like scared the crap. And look at the clock. It's going backwards. It's like not staying consistent. What are these? This is crazy. Like I'm scared to continue, but I have to. This is like good content for you guys. You guys see me cry like a baby? I, I don't like this. This is creepy. And like the ambiance with the sound is just even worse. Okay, so we're in the dining room. Like I'm like, ah, no, no. Ah, dear sweet mother. She loves you. She loves you not. No, I don't want to know. Mother's scary. I don't even know what she looks like, and she's scary already. 
This is only act one, you guys. I think there's like three acts in this um, game, I'm pretty sure. Oh, well, hi, mother. Hello, mother. How are you, creepy McCreeperson? Like, look at her. She's tall. Look at her boob sag. Like, dang, girl. You need a push up, bro. Okay, well, we're just going to talk to mother. Hamilton, my dear child, I've missed you. Hmm, really? Where have you been? How dare you frighten me like this? Oh god, I feel like we have to be nice to her because she's freaking scary as all heck. Um. Oh my god. Should I? I don't want. I want to lie to her just to see what happens, but. Um. What? What just flashed on the screen? I don't know. I was just outside, not far from here. Do you think I'm a fool? You forgot that I created you. Worthless creation that you are. You know, if I discover you're lying, I will have your father beat your skull into the floorboards. Graphic. Now tell me again. Where were you? I'm sorry. I went to the old shed in the valley. I am sorry for her language, you guys. It's, I'm just sorry right now. You spineless little shit. Lying to your own mother. Your father will beat you till your tears run dry. And when your father is done with you, I won't come to help you this time. You can cry all you want. Your father will... Wait, your father? Ah, Hamilton, I am reminded. My dear child, I have a task for you. <laughs> Please don't make me see father. Please don't. Um, what, what is this? What task is that? My sweet child, you are a good boy. What are flashing? I don't know what's flashing on the screen and it's bothering me because I want to know how you've grown. I love you, Hamilton. You do know that I love you, don't you? I need to bring your father his medication. But, but father hates me. Your father loves you, Hamilton. Almost as much as I do. He's upstairs in his room. A good lad now. Or be a good lad now. Take him his medicine. You will do that, won't you? F fine. I'll do it. Dear sweet Hamilton. Scared me. Okay, so medication. The scent urges through your nose. Your eyes water. Ooh, I don't want to know that. Ooh, no. No, thank you. Okay, so it looks like we have to go upstairs then from the outside. Let's see if anything's a little bit different. And then I may have to end this part real quick. Okay, so there's a headless statue. Kind of freaky. Nothing with the window. The crow statue and this. Okay, add to the parlor. The creepy, creepy parlor. Okay, these ugly paintings. Just freaking scary. I'm waiting for something to pop up in my freaking face. And I'm gonna die. Okay, so the foyer. Okay, is that father? I feel like that's our father. I don't know. But I feel like he's a creepy old man. Okay, so we can't do anything. We can go upstairs though. Okay, let's go upstairs. Or is that father? Do we have like four fathers? Is our mother a, um, you know, a lady of the night? So we have the door. That's our dad's room, I'm guessing. Oh my god. Is Walter the boy out Walter's room? Is Walter the boy outside that's waiting for blood on the kid's face? I don't I'm not really sure. I don't know. Can we go into Walter's room? I'm kind of scared of going to Walter's room. 
I don't know. Which one's our father's door? This one or the... Let's go to... I don't know. We'll, we'll go to Walter's room. Whew, okay. As you guys can tell, I'm like freaking scared out of my mind. Go to the hallway. It's Walter. Can I go back out? I don't want to go back. I don't want to be in here. So he's counting something. Is it all in blood too? Ah, there's Walter. I found Walter. Hi, Walter. Walter, who are you? I, I don't know. I, I don't want to hurt you. I don't want to be a bad to you. Do you want me to just leave? I'm not really just sure what to think about you right now. <gasps> That's our brother. That's our brother. Oh, my God. We're all crazy. We're literally all crazy. Oh, my God. Okay. Um. Hello, brother. Silence. Is that the kid with the blonde face? Is that who he's supposed to see? <gasps> Ooh, I'm so scared. I don't know. I feel like he's related to a little boy outside. Um, what happened to your face where there's so much blood? I feel like that'd be mean. I feel like that may have him like go crazy. So let's just do there's so much blood in here. And silence. Um, did father uh why does why does mother let this happen to you? Still silence. Okay. Brother, you're bleeding or... Do you like the pain? In silence. Um, yeah, no, we're not going to touch him by any means. We're going to leave Walter alone. Fine. I'll leave you be. Still silence. Okay, so Walter's our brother, and he's freaking crazy, and he's getting beat up by our father. That's what I'm pretty much assuming, and I'm hoping nothing jumps out at me. No. Okay, cool. Okay, so, okay. So that's Walter. Maybe that's what he looked like before. I'm not really sure. But there's our father's room. What? It said lies. I have a meat cleaver. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with it. But it said lies. Okay. So what I'm going to do, you guys, is I'm going to go ahead and wrap up the first part right here. It's already very, like, insane and psychological. I really hope that this doesn't freak you guys out too much. Let me know what you guys think about the game down in the comments below. Do you want to see more of it? Or is this all that you want to see? Is it too gruesome? Is it too anything? Do you want me to do it with the lights off? Which I really don't want to because it's really freaking scary. And... What else do you have to think about the game? Do you like it? Do you hate it? Just let me know down in the comments below. But if you guys did enjoy the video, don't forget to leave a thumbs up on the video. And next time, we'll go ahead and go into this, talk to the store. It's probably our father. We'll probably go ahead and give him his medication and probably get beat the crap out of us. So I don't really know. We'll find out in the next part. So again, like the video if you did enjoy. And if you guys are new to my channel, obviously click my other videos, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below because I'm going to see the whole world to me. And I will see you guys all in my next video. Bye, guys.